What's going on there, JD Aliens? So it is March 31st, next month is April, then we got May, and if you're anything like me, during these couple of months, you'll be waking up with a snotty, crusty nose and crusty eyes and stuff all in the back of your throat, and you're just feeling disgusting. As a matter of fact, through the month of April and May, I cry a lot. And it's not because like I'm thinking about my old high school sweetheart or you know, like something's going wrong in my life. It's because of these dang stinking allergies. But it's not going down like that this year, man. Pure Oxygen decided to send over this P500 air purifier for me to test out and show off to you guys. But I decided to use it for, I think I've had it for maybe about eight or nine days uh, in my bedroom, my master bedroom. It's roughly uh, 200 square feet, like 194 or something like that square feet just so you can get a size of the room that I'm using this in. So it's not like the largest room, but it's not the smallest room either. So it's, it's a fairly good sized room and I leave it running most of the day. I've been turning it off lately during the day and then turning it back on somewhere around maybe eight or nine o'clock at night and I, it has a sleep timer on it. So I'll set it for like three hours and just let it do its thing. And when I've been waking up in the morning, oh man, it's just so different. No scratchy throat no crusty nose. I can breathe out of both nostrils. I, I don't have the little stuff in my eyes. Well, you, you know, I always have cold in the eyes, but you know, my eyes, I remember one year, man, I used to have to go wash my face before I could actually open my eyes because I had so much gunk in my eyes. I couldn't, my eyelids were stuck together, man. <laughs> it was disgusting. But I haven't had that issue this year so far with this P500, man. I am loving this thing. I had one in my in my bedroom uh, that I was using the previous year. It was a smaller unit and it was pretty good, but something tells me it might have been a little bit too small for my bedroom size. But this one right here seems to be the perfect size for any room, as a matter of fact. I mean, 200 square feet, that's a pretty good size room and it's doing a good job. Now, the thing about air purifiers is sometimes they are super loud so you can't sleep with them. You didn't know this, or maybe you did, but it's actually on right now. I'll prove it to you. See that, see that green light right there? That means it is on, and let me put the fan up to you. Yeah. Man, that air smells clean, baby. <laughs> God, no. It's not scented or nothing. It just smells fresh, <laughs> but it's actually on. It has, is it three speeds? Hold on, let me get this remote. It comes with a remote. I think it's three speeds. We got, uh, that's one, two, you hear it? Hear it ramp up. And this is three. So yeah, let's put it back on one. So it was running the whole time in the beginning of that video. So that lets you know how quiet this thing actually can get. Now, if you have this thing on level one, you're gonna get almost pure silence. Level two, gonna hear a little bit of wind. So maybe if you got it about 10 to 12 feet away from you, you're still gonna be okay. It's gonna be very tolerable to even fall asleep with. Some people like falling asleep with a fan on, but level three, oh yeah, that's full on hurricane. You are actively cleansing the air. Like there's no doubt about it. You are cleansing air. It's sucking in the back and then you got full, like this is wind. This is straight up wind coming out of here. All right, let me turn that down a little bit. Now let's talk about what this thing actually does. It cleans the air or purifies the air through six different modes. Where's my phone? Okay, I had to look it up on the website. Man, you got the core filtration system. You got a pre-filter. Let, let me take this out for you. Okay, so if you take this thing off the back, this little grill back here, take this off the back, just like that. I should probably turn this off. Yeah, let's turn it off. You got a pre-filter, you got a HEPA filter in here, you got activated carbon filtration, you got a cold catalyst filtration, you got negative ion generation, and you have a UV light sanitizer. Yes, there is a UV light in here. I wonder, I gotta show you this, man. There is a UV light that comes on in here and it just it's just one of the six ways it sanitizes the air. I wonder if I can actually, oh, snap, okay. So yeah, there you go. <laughs> That's your UV light right there. Let me turn it back off so I don't mess anything up. And we'll just put this filter back on. These filters are replaceable and you should replace them. I don't know how long they recommend, but you should definitely check it maybe every month or every two or three months and clean it off or either or change it out but uh, I'm pretty sure it goes in just like this. That's the way it came out, right? I hope I'm doing that right. <laughs> Correct me if I'm wrong in the comments, man. I think it goes on just like that. So you just put that grill back on, put it on there like that. And then we will look at the top. So looking around at the top of here, you'll see in the middle here, you'll, you'll have your, uh, your UV icon to let you know that it's cleaning the filter. And then you have your ion icon. 
and then you have your timer there, you have your on off button, you got your fan speed right there, and then you, oh, I forgot to tell you, it does have automatic. Now, one thing about automatic, I love it and it's great for daytime use. Don't put it on automatic during the nighttime because during automatic, what this thing does is it senses the air quality and it will ramp up the fan if it senses the air, air quality is bad. So you're all of a sudden, you know, your air quality has been good for like an hour. And then at some point it'll sense that the air quality needs to be, you know, changed a little bit or cleansed a little bit and it'll ramp it up. So that could wake you up in your sleep. So if you're going to use this while you're sleeping, make sure you just put it on a solid one, two or three setting and let it ride automatic could possibly wake you up with that high fan noise. Now on the remote, you get a couple of extra things. You get your UV on uh, button right there. It's a dedicated button for the UV on and off. And then you get your function button, will, which will actually allow you to turn on that ion cleansing and stuff like that. And then you have your timer, which you can set all the way up to. Let's see what we got here. We got three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 9, 10, 11, 12. I gotta say after using this thing for roughly eight or nine days, I am very impressed with the improvements on my, my air quality as far as my allergies go. I, don't, I can't measure air quality like on my smartwatch or you know through my nose. All I know is I'm sneezing and coughing and hacking up stuff in the morning. But it hasn't been the case over the last couple of days or a few days I've been using this thing. So that tells me that something good is happening in that room. It's really hard to gauge, but this thing is doing all the work for me in the background. This is one of those pieces of tech that you didn't really know that you needed until you try it. And it's like, dang, how have I been getting along without this thing? So I like the way it's designed because it, there's a lot of white decor in my bedroom. And it's a, it's a simple design. It doesn't really take up a lot of space. You can scoot this up in the corner or up against the wall. And it's not just gonna sit there and look crazy for you. It's just gonna sit there in the background, helping you breathe better. Hey man, I'm no expert in this kind of stuff, but what I will tell you is the P500 has kept all the snot and crustiness out of my nose. <laughs> <laughs> hey man, either way, I gotta get out of here and go make some more videos. Y'all keep being good to each other and keep the snot out of your nose. <laughs> and I'll see you when I see you. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let me get this straight. You sat through this whole video, the whole thing, and never once decided to hit the subscribe button or the like button. Man, it'd be the ones closest to you. I'll see how you are. Are you not entertained? Are you not entertained? Is this not why you are here?